What is up you guys, it's Violet Taylor here and welcome back to Let's Catch a Vibe. Now, I hope it's feeling great, feeling amazing, feeling vibey. As you guys can see, tonight's item shot will take it from Saturday the 6th of January into the early Sunday morning of the 7th of January. And I want to shout out my best friend, his 30th birthday is officially tomorrow. Shout out to you bro, enough love, hope you have an amazing day. And yeah, hope it's a chilled one. So, jumping straight into the item shop. Last night we had the return of some decent items, nothing overly new. Um, but yeah, let's see what we get tonight in three, two, one, let's go! Bear in mind if I am making like out noises and that I am currently having my hair braided, so it, it, it is what it is. Anyway, starting us off into the signature series, we start ourselves off with the bracer skin. Description reads, advanced tactics, classic, cool. Part of the modern mercenary set, first introduced in OG season nine. Moving us on to the Lego style, which I do like the hair on this one. Moving us on to the return of the Omen skin. We have Legendary Rarity. Your victory has been foretold. Part of the Overseer set, first introduced in OG Season 4. We have the Lego style. This is the first time me seeing the Omen Lego style, which, not gonna lie, I like it. It looks pretty cool. Moving us on to the back bling, we have the legendary Battle Shroud, shrouded in the mystery. Again, very, very cool. Moving us on to the return of the Recon Expert. Again, another skin that we just seem to get like every couple of days, but we move. We have the Recon Expert, rare Recon Expert outfit. First introduced in OG Season 1. We then have the alternate option or alternate style option to have the Null Hat on. Oh, for example, <laughs> I didn't cover it. Moving us on, we have the return of the Recut Expert Lego style, of course. Moving us on to the return of the Jubilation Emote. A heaping helping of happiness. First introduced in OG Season 3. Moving us on to the rest of the item shop, we still have the Brat Bundle. We still have the Fate Skin. We have the Vice and the Paw Patroller. We also have the denied emotes. I did cover these recently, um, and I also covered them like last night in their own, um, in the, in, the, in, the uh, in its own item shop. Anyway, I uh, can't get my words out. Moving us on to the return of the Rave Nautilus bundle. I was wondering when this bundle was going to, uh, when this bundle was going to come back. I have already covered this in its own is it isn't that worth it bundle video. I'm only mainly here for the Lego style, which yeah. I know they're filtering through and I know they're probably going to go over these. This is just to get it out. But this looks absolutely nothing like this. I mean, again, it's probably hard to do most of it. They could at least do something with the hair, maybe. But eh, it is what it is. Anyway, moving us on to the rest of some items. We have the return of the Night Beam skin. Beaming with luminous energy. Part of the Stormlight set, first introduced in OG Season 9. As you guys can see, we do have um, alternate styles. So we've got the default here, which is like the light up style. And then we also have the, um, sorry, the glow style. Then we have the alternate, which is the no glow. Again, I appreciate both, but I'd like the glow more than the no glow. Moving us on to, this is the first time I've seen the Night Beam um, Lego skin as well. Eh, it's okay. I think it'll do. Anyway, moving us on to the Lumi Core Red Backbling. Do not disturb. Hmm. 9001. I'm still trying to figure out what that means. Anyway, moving us on to the male skin, we have the flare. Burn bright. Part of the Stormlight set, first intrusion OG season 9. Again, we've got the same styles. We've got the glow style. And then we have the alternate, which is the no glow style. Moving us on to the Lego flare skin. Not bad, I like this one a bit more. Not bad. Moving us on to his back bling, we have the Lumicore Green. Do not tap the glass. Again, I'd love to know where these came from because they look pretty cool. Anyway, moving us on to the Splintered Light Harvesting Tool, we have Share the Light. Let's see this one gonna mention. Ah, there we are. Moving us on to the Mega Bat Glider, Saw with the Storm. This is a really, really cool glider that I do appreciate. Anyway, moving us on to the return of the Outcast and the Depth Dealer skin. So starting us off, we have the Outcast skin. Reel him in. Part of the open water set, first introduced in Chapter 2, Season 1. 
We then have the alternate style, which is the alter ego, which gives you a nice little uh, beanie there. Really, really cool. Love the nice little uh, purple accents as well. Moving us on to the Lego skin. I mean, again, it, it'll do, but yeah, just, just add the hair at least. But never mind. Anyway, moving us on to the Fresh Catch Back Bling. Catch and Release. Part of the open water set, again, pretty cool. Moving us on to the alternate, we do have the blue style. Moving us on as well to the Depth Dealer skin. Deep Six Competition. Again, looking absolutely badass. If you guys know me, big fan of pouches and skins. He's got some grenades there, extra rounds. Yo, this guy was tooled for battle. Like, this guy was tooled up. Anyway, moving us on to the Depth Dealer Lego style. I mean, again, yeah, it is what it is. Pretty cool though. Moving us on to the back bling, we have the Wave Piercer. It's open season on the open water. Yeah, no shit. This guy's literally tooled up and ready for that open open, uh, open season. Anyway, really, really cool. Loving the extra pouches, pockets, grenades. Got a um, ammo belt there. Moving us on to the bottom, we still have the Gilded Great. So as you guys can see, we have the Gold Blooded Ace Bundle. I have already covered this in its own Is It Not Worth It Bundle video, like last season ago. Um, well, maybe last chapter now. Uh, anyway, moving us on, no new gem tracks. We still have your boy The Weekend. We still got the Meet Your Roadie section where we have the spark plug with two styles. And then we also have the Big Lug um, Base Festival skin. Moving us on, we still got the Dragon Ball collaboration with us. Moving us on, we had the Ripley and Xenomorph Bundle return last night. Returning tonight, we have the Yennefer of Venneberg Bundle. We also have the Civi Pack. Some really, really cool items in here. I have already covered these both in their own Is It Isn't That Worth It Bundle videos. I also covered them on my TikTok as well. It would have been a while ago now. When was this? Chapter 4, Season 3. Yeah, so it would have been a while ago now. But anyway, really, really cool. Especially if you guys have are into The Witcher, and especially if you've just watched the Netflix um, seasons and stuff. Anyway, moving us on to the rest of the item shop. We still have the Lamborghini Huracan STO. We have, ooh, okay. So let's swap the diesel bundle out for the Jaguar, the Jaguar 619. Some people were asking me when this is gonna come back. Now you've got it. Moving us on to the special offers and bundles. Well, yeah, eh, not really the best item shop. It picked up a bit. Like we've had the return of the Jaeger, I'll oh, sorry, not Jaguar. I said Jaguar, didn't I? Jaeger 619 bundle. We've got the return of that, we've got the return of some Witcher items. Eh, the item shop's picking back up a bit. Not overly, but eh, it's picking up a bit. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button. If you didn't enjoy the video, let me know in the comments down below why you like the video. Also, let me know which is your favorite item and bundle from tonight's item shop. Also, again, Shout out to my best friend, um, Jim Taylor. Happy birthday, your 30th birthday. And yeah, let's uh, see if we can link up. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the rest of the art video. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new and join Tim Let's Catch a Vibe. Also, if you are new, please don't forget to switch on the bell notifications to get notified as soon as that load. But more importantly, don't forget to stay by me. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Peace.